you look good, you feel good, now you're making money, you got a business, time for a wifey. And um, that's how I felt when I started recreating my life, right? Okay, I'm in this stage of my life, I'm gonna build a family. Um, and I thought about a potential women these days that might be marriage material. And I saw on your profile that uh, you had a contrast of what a the best woman in your life would be. So uh, Jordan, if you wouldn't mind playing that video, let's take a look at this uh, beautiful example of what to look for. <laughs> what is this? Oh, uh, you gotta give him that oh. hump to and spit all that night. You get me? <laughs> Versus. Yeah. So this is your, her, uh, your uh -huh. first, your first That's dating. Yeah, it's probably 2012. If you like this song. So she's, she's hooking up your house. Yeah. Yeah, okay. she's just, you know, she, I mean, that was her, that's just her. Yeah. Right? That's who she was. And sometimes we don't know why we're so attracted to someone. <laughs> and to be honest, I'd never had a woman come yeah. over to my house. You yeah. know, I mean, I, I wasn't, yeah. I wasn't the perfect, you know, Christian. So I had, I had girlfriends that we lived together yeah. and all that. It wasn't ever long term, but, you know, I had women over at the house and they never acted like that. Wow. And I didn't even know. They I act like the first one. The, yeah. the, the first one. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. In your 20s, that's, that's the Hakua girls. Yeah. Like, you know, woman of your youth and your stupidity yeah. versus your maturity. Yeah. You, you now bring a, bring a wife into your Yeah, yeah. And no criticism life. against that girl. I mean, that girl that went, went famous, you know, it's just like, you know, I, personally, even in my 20s, mm. I, if I had a, I was mm. never interested in a woman who talked like that publicly. Yeah. Behind yeah. the scenes? Oh, yeah. Sure. Know, what did they say? Uh, uh, a a lady in the, the streets, <laughs> but a freak in the sheets. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. <laughs> I like that. And, and uh, you know, that's what I found, man. That's, <laughs> that's ludicrous, bro. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. And uh, that, that's what I found. But, well, yeah, she came over, and I just loved and, and she goes viral, man. She got another video. She was 27 yeah. million views. And yeah. when she shows her loving... Uh, just loving desire to be a uh, provider or nurturer yeah. for our family. Like it just freaks some of the younger generation out. And so, yeah, that situation, I was just like, listen, you know, I'm not, I'm not saying this versus that, but I'm saying, yeah, if her first instinct is not to come over to your place and, you know, make sure that um, you're, you're taken care of. I mean, yeah. she doesn't need to come over and just clean your place. Right. right, right. But that should be within her yeah. and, and, and some people think oh you need to wait till marriage to do that yeah. dude i'm not waiting for uh, to, to see the characteristics of my perfect woman so after marriage yeah are y'all crazy yeah you need to show you, men are constantly showing what their capabilities are before marriage women are as well and when i saw her do that yeah people were like why'd you film it i'm like yeah. because first of all social media wasn't even massive then yeah. but i had to show my friends i had to show off I'm like, look at this. Like, yeah. we, we woke up and yeah. she tidied the bed and cleaned up the kitchen. Yeah. And she does it to this day. She yeah. did it this morning. Yeah. Like, you know, the thing that she had to do with me when we were dating is that, because uh, we, you know, our guys are trained, a lot of our sales forces part time. So a lot of our guys would be trained on evenings and weekends. And one Saturday, we'd be, we know we were going to about 11 midnight on a Saturday night. And I'm dating my girlfriend, Sheena. She's like, babe, you had no training, no insurance agency until midnight on a Saturday. I swear, babe. I swear, I swear to God. I mean, I mean, no joke. So she comes in on a Saturday. She sees that we're actually really training. We're really there. We're really, you know, in it. And so she sends me a text around six o'clock later on that night because she leaves the office. She goes home because we're not living together yet. She goes, babe, I just left the house. One let you know the house is filled with a, you got a fridge full of beer and you got a bucket of chicken ready Ooh, to go. Bucket of chicken. Yeah, bucket of chicken. Ready to go. <laughs> I'm like, I said it to my guys. Yo, dog, check this out. This is what Sheena did. I'm like, dog, you better wife her up. Yeah. You know. But uh, there's something about when a woman shows those displays that because she take care of she can take care of man she can take care of her family or children fair for, for, for me I, I'm, I share you probably say the same thing too as well yeah. it's a very attractive quality yeah in a it's, woman. it's rare you can't train yeah. for that yeah she she was probably and i talk to her mom and dad about all the time i tell them yeah. how grateful i am i say yeah. thank you for being such great parents right. i That's tell right. them that all the time and her mom i love her she's the one to introduce us right wow she was such a person a personable social yeah kind person yeah you know that's that's when i met her the same day right yep. went through that whole valley went through that yep. long period and then i went i was abstinent mm -hmm. i haven't been abstinent for, for a year or wow. longer and, and since i was a teenager and but i yeah meet her mom at a pool party at encore beach club yeah. i had just in won, vegas yeah 
Let you, you know, every time I was at Encore Beach yeah, Club yeah. the previous five, six years, yeah. I would have been wasted. Wow. Exactly. I would have been, been high on ecstasy or taking a drug or I'd have been drunk as a skunk, <laughs> like a fool. Yeah. And yeah, you know, that's what I thought was cool. But then yeah. here I am, Encore Beach Club, sober, not drinking, just won my IFBB Pro card. Yeah. And then I'm standing in a pool and I see a beautiful, yeah. you know, older woman and, you know, start talking to her because she's with our group and she goes in her deep, deep Cajun accent goes, you got to meet my daughter. She's like, you're going to marry her someday. And she was joking, but yeah, yeah. come to find out. So like that, but because of her mom, her, you yeah. know, her mom and the way she's always been yeah. and her dad, the way he's always been, right. She's a, 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 a you know, a reciprocal of that. Yep. Right. Like she, and so, yeah, people always say like, man, how did, they, they think we force our women to stay at home and do the things like, no, man, they kind of force us to not, to, to, you know, to not help them, right? That's I'm right. Not sure. like, <laughs> I try to get up and cook. She's like, no, I got this. Yeah. I got this. Yep. Amen to that. Yeah.